Hi, my name is Pop. I'm making a video tutorial in Ubuntu Basics showing some quick ways you can move around inside of Nautilus and Unity. Let, let's say I'm opening up a my home folder and I want to go into a folder within a folder within a folder. I'm opening up Documents and I just tapped it and it's going to open up and when that opens up I'm going to go inside of that folder and as you can see I'm frustrated because it's at the bottom out of sight and I'm opening up this folder and finally I get to the folder that I want to open up. One might argue I've got too many folders nested like Russian Easter eggs but that's the way I did it. And these are all of the YouTube videos that I have made for Ubuntu Basics and there's over a hundred of them. Well you can make a bookmark when you are in Nautilus and it's really easy to do. You've got to be inside of the folder that you want and then you hit bookmark and you hit add bookmark and suddenly it appears and that folder is up there. You cannot put an individual file and you cannot drag and drop like you used to years ago. After you have done this and you go over here and you right click there it is and you open it right up. And then that's that's very handy to do. If you want to get rid of this thing, you highlight it, right click it, and then you can remove it. You can do that with anything. But we now have Unity and Unity is even faster. You just open this up, go to Files and Folders, that's with a right click and you type in oh just the first letter or something of a file and there it is. I'll have to give them that. This is much much faster. Unity was something that I was uh, very very slow to get into but now that I'm using it I really do like it. If you want to get even faster than that you can make a keyboard shortcut. I want to show you the method that is used with uh, the terminal. I went Control Alt T and you would type in Nautilus space slash home user documents with a capital. The next file down and then finally the file you want. And then when I hit enter it's going to open up Nautilus. Before doing that let me copy this. I want to uh, copy this for a particular reason because I want to make a keyboard shortcut for it. I've got it highlighted so I hit edit and copy. But forget that I copied it for a second. I'm just going to hit enter and sure enough there it is. I've got Nautilus. Do you happen to remember there used to be gym equipment called Nautilus? I don't know if they still have it. And uh, well Captain Nemo's submarine, Jules Verne's Captain Nemo, he had a submarine called the Nautilus and it's na named after the chambered Nautilus. The chambered Nautilus has got a container within a container within a container. And the gym equipment guy, he was kind of funny because uh, he was interviewed once and he was an old bachelor and uh, apparently he was a ladies man. And he wanted three things out of life, he said. Bigger crocodiles, faster airplanes, and younger women. I remember that with the word Nautilus for some reason. I've got this copied now and I have a prior video that shows how to do this. You go over here to System Settings and when system settings opens up do not go to keyboard layout go to keyboard and keyboard has in it shortcuts and you go to the very bottom where it says custom shortcuts and you're gonna make a new one so you hit the plus sign and we're gonna call it Ubuntu basics and then remember I copied that business and I hit control V to paste and let me just see if I've got it all pasted correctly. I'm going to zoom in on it. 
Nautilus space slash home slash pop slash capital documents slash YouTube slash Ubuntu basics. You got to have your spaces correctly and your capitalization correctly and your spelling correctly. Uh, Ubuntu and Linux is very unforgiving that way. Well, I've got the new one in there, but it does not have a keyboard accelerator yet. So when you tap on it, I'm going to hit Windows key, Alt key simultaneously with one finger because they are right next to each other, and then U. So I've got three keys that will open up Ubuntu Basics folder. When I close this, all I got to do is hit Window Alt U. And there it is. That's pretty quick. Or I can go over here, right click, and there it is. And that's pretty quick. But I had to prepare ground for both of those. Whereas with Unity, all I do is hit dash home, put in the U, and where the heck is it? And there it is. Without doing anything, I got it just as fast through Unity. I want to show you also again how you can make a keyboard shortcut to open up keyboard shortcuts. Instead of going over here and going to System Settings and opening it up in that manner, I'm just going to go ahead and open it up. Instead of doing this, you can make a keyboard shortcut to open up this very keyboard shortcut. And that is over here. And it's, I'm looking for a K on the end. Do you see a K? There it is. Control Alt K keyboard shortcuts. Let me zoom in. And if you will type this in, gnome dash control dash center space keyboard and that's it and that opens up this thing control alt K and there it is my name is pop and I have a whole bunch of YouTube videos called Ubuntu Basics and I enjoy making them and I enjoy more hearing from people and if this was useful to you I would like to hear from you thank you very very much